What is up YouTube, Nintendo Gaming back here, and I'm going to teach you guys how to set up the capture card and everything. But first guys, let's get into the intro guys. Welcome back guys, now let's start with um, an easy start. I've got this Nintendo Switch, as you may know. So this here, the one from the Nintendo Switch goes into the input. Like that. One that's coming from your laptop, which I'll show you guys in a minute. Goes in next to the um, output one. It flashes when it's in the laptop. So the one on the laptop, which is here, goes into a USB port. Like that, and it'll make a, that noise. The one from the TV goes into the output. Turn on my TV so it should work. Don't know why my TV was off, guys, but it automatically turned off. There you go, guys. So it's in and on with the laptop. I'm going to show you guys how to download the app. I've already got the app over there, over here. So I'm going to show you how to download it on this laptop, which is my rubbish laptop. So this is the one here that I've downloaded. The capture for Windows. I've already downloaded it. It took like 10 minutes to download. When you open it, if it wants to open, which I doubt that it does, should be on the home page. No, it's not. Here you go. It's preparing to install. So you've got to wait until it installs. So you set up the wizard thing. Please wait to set up the wizard prepares to guide you. Migrating feature states from related applications. So I've already installed this on this laptop beforehand, but I've deleted it off so you guys can um see me do it. So for this this is the license, this is the agreement that you've got to agree to. So I've just pressed accept the terms and conditions for the license. So help to improve HD60 capture by sharing anonymous data use, usage data, which I'm still going to keep that ticked. So the Elgato Captcha, so the sound capture, you can keep that one. Because it helps you talk to people on Discord or Skype or like other things. It can help you also play music on your videos if you like to listen to music. <clears throat> so keep that ticked. Because it's an additional app which works pretty well. That's to install it on one of the files and then install. So it might take a while to install. So while we're waiting for that to install in the background, guys, I will link all of these. Like I'll link the um download thing in the description. I'll link this one, the Elgato Game Capture requirements. Now, guys, this is immediately important. It is extremely important, guys, that you follow Buddy's rules. Rules, because I had it on the pink laptop that I've got now. My grey laptop over there is the strongest, the strong enough one to stream. I started on this laptop first because I thought it was going to be good. I brought the capture card and everything, started streaming, and it started like buffering. It started like freezing, and it didn't look very good. And I will show you guys one of the videos in a minute. After I've um told you about these um system requirements, I'm not gonna read all of them out, guys. I'll just show you them, then you can read them yourselves. Not to be mean, though, guys. Like it is kind of hard to read it off a phone. 
Because if I try and read off her thing, I'll end up moving the camera away from So right now guys, I'll go over here. This is what the software looks like when it's downloaded. So all you need to do is just download on my other computer. So here's the other computer that I've got. You need to link your um, account. Just link your account on here. As you guys know, my YouTube is Nintendo Gaming. So I've linked it onto the live streaming. You can actually name what you want on here. For example, Splatoon or Fortnite. This computer will do for now. If you want to live stream, guys, you press this button here, stream. But as you guys may know, you need a microphone to start streaming. You need a microphone to um, start the streaming, guys. So I've got a blue snowball microphone, which uses a USB as well. Plug that into the USB. All we need to do is um, microphone blue snowball. Press this button, which is the commentary button. So, as you guys may know, as I go closer to the microphone, my voice gets higher on here. Also, with the game volume, the game audio, you can make it higher or lower. And also with the additional app, the Elgato capture software, if I put that into gear, let's put it into gear now. So you could go on advanced. And there we go guys. But if you're going to use a Discord, guys, you've got to put earphones into your system and listen to them through them. And you can, through the earphones, while you talk through the microphone. And it possibly helps you hear them, because so there isn't an echo on your stream, guys. I've got mine on Advanced, because it's much more easier for me to stream on Advanced. But for now, I turn it off, because I'm not really streaming at the moment, guys. I'll stream after my video. As I'm planning a stream after the video, this is just a quick video for you guys to learn how to do it. So, right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial on how to set up your Elgato software and how to set up your capture card. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe, guys. And now, I'd like to get into the outro, guys.